Alright, here we go. I'll probably do the editing anyways. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> you wanna kick it off? Oh yeah. Um, kick it off. Howdy, y'all. Seriously? Oh, oh, there's no, there's nothing professional about this yet. What's up, everybody? Welcome to our first ever uh, episode of the podcast. Oh, or just random talking the whole time, because honestly, we, on, honestly, 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 we don't have any structure yet. So this is kind of just a test run. So yeah. speed, speed run, baby. So um, how's your day? My day was pretty good. Um, it wasn't very eventful. I had yeah. Mexican with your family. Mm, yeah, that does sound that was good. really fun. It was a uh, like what Tolteca. Ah, yeah. what does that mean? Yeah. Uh, in English, maybe like a temple. Temple? I don't, I don't know. It's like a, you know it, the pyramid. The, the well, pyramid yeah, thing, but yeah. there's a like a pyramid on the outside and on the actual like menu. So I'm thinking maybe it means do with maybe that. it means the pyramid. Maybe, but that's weird. Pyramids are. Yeah. Like, Egypt. If you guys don't know, there's like, okay, so we live in, we're from Lebanon, and Lebanon is based upon, two, no, three types of restaurants or eating places. <laughs> yes. Mexican, Chinese, or pizza. That's, that's all there is. Oh. And most of the time, it's not good pizza. Well, okay, it depends. Like, Cornerstone is really good. Boondocks. I've never been to Boondocks. That's really? not technically in Lebanon, though. That's in, like, yeah, Ellsburg well, area. Yeah. Well, if you're saying that, then I don't live in Lebanon either. Yeah, you do. Right outside the border. No. Yeah, that's where Boondocks is. Right, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, like Mexican, Chinese pizza is uh, is really all there is to eat. And then there's like a couple other places like Applebee's. Um, yeah. <laughs> Applebee's, yeah. yeah. Applebee's is the most fancy you get in Lebanon. And well, it's... there's Madison Street Grill. That doesn't but count. But it's super expensive. That doesn't count. No one eats there. Unless Actually, there's quite a bit of people unless they're there. Unless they're not from Lebanon. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> if you're from Lebanon, you don't make enough money to eat there. Eh, well, I mean, you could. But it'd cost you an arm and a leg, though. <laughs> so. You don't make enough arms and legs to oh, okay. eat. Oh, <laughs> okay. Since, since we're on the topic of food, where is like your ultimate favorite place to go to eat? Like, not in Lebanon. Like, just in general. Like, if they're like, yo, where do you want to go eat? Mm. You say. Well, you know, <coughs> I'd have to go through all the restaurant restaurants that I've actually been to. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, but like, out of those, which ones, like, like your favorites? Like, not just one, like your favorites, like that well, automatically come to your head. Like, well, you know, I want to go there. The ones that automatically come to my head are the ones that I go to the most, but those are probably not my favorite because the ones I go to the most are like Sunday e or Sunday afternoon lunches, okay, which yeah, is true. El Som and yeah, uh, El Som's really good. El, El, El Sombrero, stop there. It's the hat, really good. Oof, yeah, um, good stuff. Honestly, rest in peace, El Charo, though. Uh, are they out of business? Um, no, all of their staff got deported. Oh, yeah, because they were illegal immigrants. <laughs> nice. Uh, tequila shut down too. That was a Mexican oh, yeah, restaurant, dang. but now it's called Smokehouse Grill or something like that. Firehouse Grill. I don't remember what it's called. Tease is pretty good. Tease Redneck Steakhouse. Uh, I, I don't. I'm not. It was good at one tea. point. I haven't been there in a while. Yeah. Okay, my favorite restaurants or go tos are like Nicados. Um, I mean, Nicados and Hinodes are basically the same thing. So either of those two. Olive Garden, love Olive Garden. Um, ooh, Hoo Hot. Hoo Hot is Hoo Hot's pretty good. at the top of the list for me. I love Hoo Hot. Haven't been there very often. Oh, but. dude, Hoo Hot's the bomb. And Texas Roadhouse, hands down. I love steak. So, steak. And their rolls with the butter. Oh, the Lambert's, though. Lambert's. Has, oh, my gosh. Honestly? If you've never been to Lambert's, you are straight up missing out. Lambert's is probably up there. I. Yeah, if, but it's super expensive. But it is. The drinks they give you are like this yeah. tall, and then the meals are like literally in a Here's giant a skillet. Here's a question. Are you allowed to take the cups home from Lambert's? You know, I've wondered that myself. Because I did it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, it, was a, it was a soccer trip to Lambert's. It was like nice. the, last, the last game. Did they was, say anything? No. Oh. I mean, we ate there, and I was I was chugging that sweet tea. It was so good. Oh, dude, yeah, I did too. I went through like three cups of yeah, that. Yeah, they refilled it, and uh, then we were all starting to leave, and so I was like, I'm not gonna leave this here. Yeah, yeah. I just I just picked Walking it up without, out the door. Yeah, without thinking. I didn't know. Like, apparently, you're not supposed to take them. But uh, yeah, see, I I thought people could because 
they I mean, live fairly they new. They don't all the say time. that you can't, and also and plus it's like, COVID. Yeah, if it's a if don't it's a people custom from cup, the same if, thing. if your restaurant gives out custom cups instead of cheap plastic cups, amen. How you can take them all? Yeah, that's, that's like a just, sign. That's, that's the a law. Sign. It's the law. <laughs> Oh my god. So if it's the law to take home If Lambert's is watching this, I'm sorry I robbed you of your cup. Dude, uh, they're gonna come to your house now and be like In Lebanon. Cup back. <laughs> you just, might as well hand out your address. In in the outskirts of Lebanon that yeah. we just described. Where we five live. seven three hey, hello, hey, oh. ah. <laughs> just kidding. It's false false uh, No, that's definitely my address. Oh my gosh. Train. So speaking speaking of that, this one time there was a girl from Camdenton. Uh, she was down in Lebanon and she had kind of a like a thing for me, I guess you could say. And she goes, I want to hang out. I was like, oh yeah, sure. You know, like, let's hang out. It was like midnight or like one o'clock in the morning. So I was like, I'm not leaving my bed. It's not happening. <laughs> so, so she goes, uh, where are you at? We'll come meet you. I was like, I'm at my house. And she goes, what's your address? So I, I literally look up houses for sale in Lebanon. <laughs> I kid you not. I'm dead serious. I'm dead serious. I look up houses for sale in Lebanon. <laughs> I sent her the address. I texted to her. She goes, all right, we're headed there. We'll be there in like 15 minutes. I was like, all right, cool. Oh, she, my gosh. She shows up to the house, and she said, we're here. I said, all right, thanks for stopping by. <laughs> she left me on open and never talked to me again. <laughs> and I was like, that was like a praise the Lord moment because I did not want to see that chick. Oh, my gosh. But, yeah. Have so. you seen her since? No. Oh, wait. No, I haven't, actually. Is she from here? She's from Camdenton, so oh, yeah, nice yeah, way, yeah. yeah, yeah. I see. I saw her at the fair one year though, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> "Did you like? Did you engage in conversation?" Oh no, absolutely not. I was like, I'm good. <laughs> no, I'm out. Yeah, I'm, I was like, I'm out of here. Was there an awkward lock eyes moment? Uh, probably more than once. Yeah, yeah I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, wow. Oh, this man. is definitely took a twist. We started out talking about. Absolutely nothing. Then we talked about food, and now we're at... Yeah, this is exactly what I wanted out of yeah, the podcast. So, uh, so we should probably give them a little bit of background Yeah, what this is going to be. Uh, most of the time, it'll probably be structured, but sometimes we'll probably just like ramble about mm-hmm. whatever. Some Sometimes we'll start with a topic, like, yeah. but this time there wasn't one. <laughs> no, I mean, you could say the topic was... Starting favorite, a podcast? Yeah, or like favorite places to eat or yeah. whatever. Whatever you want to say it was, yeah. so... The title of the episode will probably be, um, like something like "Welcome to the Podcast" or yeah, or yeah, something like that. Favorite places to eat. Favorite food. Favorite or, food. No, yeah, favorite place favorite to restaurant. Eat. Yeah. Oh, Christmas is right around the corner. It is. Are you excited? I am, bro. I'm I am so hyped. Excited. I don't know why. Like I love Christmas, <coughs> but this year, I think it's because it's twenty twenty. But this yeah. year specifically. I am hyped. Dude, same. I don't know why. Like, I'm just like, let's freaking go. Yeah. Maybe it's because I know, like, some of the stuff I'm getting, and I'm just like, I have no idea what I'm getting. Stoked about it. Well, I know a couple things that Bailey's getting me. Yeah. Uh, She's getting me a drum throne Mm -hmm. for. Does it have a back? No, I don't like the backs, too. I like the backs. We had had one in uh, Hartville with a back. With a back support. Yeah. It was. They're okay, but, like, the one at First Assembly, not my favorite. Uh, No, it's not. If you guys are into drumming, we're like watching drum videos. Go check out my channel, Gabe Mitchell. I edit most Gabe, of his stuff. Gabe Mitchell, not Gabe Mitchell. Gabe Mitchell. Just want to make it clear. I'm not gay. He likes boys. Uh, I have a yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see how that's so funny. <laughs> because you agreed. No, I said yeah, no. I said yeah, no. N- yeah, no. He just doesn't want to admit no, it. No, I would say my little cuss word deal, but th- uh, that would not be appropriate. You mean Father Mucker Bigger Niche? Oh my gosh. Now we have to, we have to bleep that out. Like, oh my gosh. Stupid. Anyways. It's past three minutes. We can cuss. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Anyways, guys, uh, we're probably going to wrap it up. So I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little. I wasn't aware of this. Oh, we're going to wrap it up. <laughs> All right, I guess we're going to wrap it up. Anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little, like, just random talking. Uh, I promise they're going to be more structured and a lot more fun. We're going to be doing uh, all kinds of different topics, like hot topics like presidential election, all that stuff, um, Christianity, stuff like, you know, whatever you guys want to hear. Leave a comment down below. Uh, but, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. And don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. And we will see you in the next video. Anything Check you out see? the description for each of our channels. Heck, yeah. Do it right now. We don't We're know watching. where this... 
podcast is going to be uploaded yet, but... Yeah, either one of our channels, at Gabe, or Mitchell, a new, or, a new or Mogar the Maywin. <laughs> he so, knows how to pronounce yeah. it, he just... Ma- Malin. Mauian. I hate him. So Ma- Mauian. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, anyways, yeah, uh, talk to you later. Dude. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. I think that was actually...